We live in a world of connected devices and this brings to our lives a lot of conveniences but it also means that we're becoming increasingly vulnerable to cyber threats. These electronic devices that communicate pose vulnerabilities and create sometimes single points of attacks that can be exploited by malicious users. The strength of cybersecurity of Swansea University is viewing this as a global entity and not specialising on just a single threat. We cover a wide variety of topics including soft security, as in trust in systems, mobile security regarding communications between mobile devices, IoT security, the Internet of Things, smart homes, how can protocols increase the security of these devices, but also the growing area of artificial intelligence and AI in systems that has a dual function in terms of security. It can be either used for actually securing systems by automatically monitoring the traffic and finding anomalies, but it can also be used to automate attacks. So we've got to be very careful in how to use AI and how this might itself introduce new vulnerabilities. Students can expect research-led teaching in a brand new dedicated building with dedicated facilities, including a cybersecurity lab that includes an isolated network in which penetration testing can be performed without any effect on the outside world. The computational foundry is not just a building on the New Bay campus. It forms a community that incorporates insights from businesses and governments into a holistic view of computer science taught here at the computational foundry. Similar to the demand of data analysts, there is a growing demand of cybersecurity specialists in industry. And this ranges from penetration testing over verification to secure web development. And all of these are covered by our program.